dry rest of the day, Brian, for folks? Yeah, certainly trending that way. Uh, we're starting to see the clouds break apart uh, farther west. Uh, still a few mountain flurries or a snow shower may still pop up, but will continue to fade out this evening. Uh, mostly sunny and cool for Thursday. We'll start to bring back some clouds later this week. We are looking at a milder weekend, but a wet Sunday uh, in the works moving forward. Uh, winter weather advisory still going uh, for many of our northern and western counties, including Grayson, Ash, Watauga, set to expire at four o'clock. And you look at a wider perspective over Virginia and the Carolinas, you see the coverage of the rain has really shrunk quite a bit. Still have some clouds and some moisture, limited moisture moving up the mountain slopes, helping to create at least a few snowflakes up that way. We've got a clear sky really Every, in all locations east of the mountains right now, we continue to see some improving conditions and the winds that are strong enough to cool the wind chill temperatures down into the mid 20s are also starting to dry out the very wet roads that we had in place overnight and early this morning. And that is going to be key to keep this from becoming a travel problem later tonight as temperatures dip into the 30s and eventually the 20s by early tomorrow morning. Dry roads are key under these sunny skies today. Uh, temperatures are going to in the wind chill column kind of differ quite a bit just depending on where the blow winds are blowing more strongly. 20s farther north and west, lower 40s where we have a bit of a breeze, but where the winds are calm, it's feeling like the upper 40s and lower 50s. We move ahead through time. A few scattered clouds will be possible. More sun for the afternoon and clear skies tonight, allowing temperatures to dip to near 30. This is why we're concerned about anything wet that could refreeze tomorrow. Uh, temperatures uh, for Thursday back in the lower 50s. Uh, we'll bring some more uh, cloud cover back uh, for your Friday, but overall conditions are looking pretty good there and at least are looking dry. Sunshine temperatures up near 50 as they peak early mid afternoon and then start to cool after that. We'll fall into the 30s pretty quickly after dark tonight, down near freezing shortly after midnight tonight on our way to temperatures in the upper 20s to near 30. Uh, upper 40s today for the foothills. Good sun for you too as we start to clear things out later on tonight. Mountain temperatures to remain windy and then we'll start to later this evening bring down those temperatures below freezing. We have impact icons for potential refreeze, although I don't think it's going to be a big issue tonight through Thursday. Clear skies turning colder again for Friday and for Saturday. We'll have periods of clouds and sunshine. Milder weather as temperatures get close to 60 Friday and then into the 60s this weekend. It is a warm but wet and windy Sunday. You you can see in the hour by hour forecast bringing the rain in Sunday morning through the afternoon could see some good rainfall totals coming through models indicating one to two inches of rain will be a possibility and we cool things down once we get into Monday and Tuesday.